and as I'm just about to start the podcast of Business Daily, which is rather wonderful. And this is take two. I'm off on an emergency beano, hashtag EB, possibly a little bit of a TR as well, which is tiny rebel. Normally when I take an emergency day off, it pours with rain. It is rain forecast from four o'clock onwards. Actually, it's not quite. That's better. So, 23rd July 2014, 06.41, Newport, Godfrey Morgan, Weatherspoon's Cider Festival, and various other things. It's very humid. But it is summer. Count your blessings. Yeah. Stop Hill in Newport. Less humid, slightly cooler, very pleasant. And might be popping there later. Especially now they're following me on Twitter. We have a plan. Oops. This is free. The music will probably get this video taken down. And outside, there's an Italian market thing, what do they call it? I bought a spoon. It's actually a spork. Everything is a good in the world. Doesn't even make sense. But what the hell? And the tide? The tide is going out. This is why I'm here. <laughs> They've just watered the flowers and they look really good. Hmm. Okay, enough. For big coal, a Mr. Manning. Quality carpet. Cranberry juice. 23 minutes. One pint of ale, two halves of cider. Then we move on. Just to prove I am drinking halves, half pint. Farmer cider by Cornish Orchards, 4.8% alcohol by volume. Cameron National Cider Champion 2012, very fruity. Mm. Um, still, I like it. <laughs> Great review, I like it. Good, but not great. B plus. Number two, Cross Farm Perry by the Bottle Kicking Cider Company. I prefer the term Perry as opposed to Pear Cider. It smells a lot better than it is. A bit cloudy, lovely aroma. Still. Full flavour. You can taste the perriers, taste the pears as part of the finish. P plus. We're on the ale. It looks like a golden ale. It says Village Idiot by White Horse at 4.1. Carbon. Carbon dioxide. Oh, very lemony, very sharp, fizzes along the top of the tongue, technical term, B++, that is good, British ales, American hops, hybrid, tons of flowers to Linton as well. That's 
it, which is good news, which is security. Ryan Brewery, that is Baptist Christian's boy, which is something we can do. I forgot that, I left it in the emergency photo. That's what Kiwi folks sent up for by volume back on the banks. Blackley's saying, stop the appling, blue charge me. You've got a space here. Anyway, oh, and you've got a sale for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is not good. Yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, mixed bread. Chips. Yeah, I'm not sure what it says. Mm. Wow. I'm gonna go for eight minus. If you like the tiny rebel boys, you'll love that. Pops, pops. 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 Meanwhile, Paul's chicken breast and half a rack of ribs, Bengali tiger, craft load. Craft there, craft you, hopefully. In the lamb for the quality craft ales. In a tiny rebel glass. Wow, slurred. Uh, box clever ales. And I can't remember what it is. It's 4.7% alcohol by volume, which is it's fine. And it's called Soul Train. Oh, and pictures. She was on drugs. Who'd have thought? Oh, look at that. Ah, great. And there's the outside world. Roman knowledge. Mm. I'm not going to show what that is. It's okay, but it's quite anonymous. Let's go for B+. Plus. Yeah, I just have. And this is the pen and wig. There's the food. There's the order. Here's the tech, some of it. And here's the beer. In a kite glass. This is Rich Ruby by Malson of 1.5%. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, it sounds like a mild. If it's a mild, it's quite fruity. It's nice. And fruity. B. What colour is it in? It's sweaty. Which is horrible. Rock and roll. 